Hello and welcome to another Minecraft video. On today's video, I'm going to be talking about the Enderman. Now, of course, the Enderman isn't a mod, it's just a normal mob. We all know what one is. He's three blocks tall and is very dangerous. So I'm just going to show you the stat, show you what he can do. Um, maybe tell you something you probably didn't know about him. So first of all, what he can do. He has 20 hearts of health, and when on easy, he can inflict 4 hearts of damage. On normal, 7 hearts, and on hard, 10 hearts. Which means he can kill you in one hit if you're on hard. Of course, being three blocks tall, he's in an invisible trap. Uh, you could know how to make them if you looked at one of my previous videos. Um, otherwise, you won't, or you might. Yeah, you probably will. But I've had to put in a piece of glass so you'll see him. There he is. Pretty tall. So, what can he pick up? All of this. He can pick up grass, dirt, mycelium, sand, gravel, clay, netherrack, dandelions, roses, red and brown mushrooms, cacti, pumpkins, melons, and TNT. Other than that, he can pick up nothing else. He can't pick up obsidian, he can't pick up iron blocks, I don't know, whatever you want to give him. And as you can see, as a perfect example, he's picked up the floor. Be careful if you make an invisible trap with an enderman. Put something you can't pick up around him. So, um, one quick trick I want to show you is with the cactus. I know this isn't strictly relevant, but I just want to show you. So a lot of people will use lava as a bin. Why, though? It's much more, it's much more dangerous than cacti, which takes all dropped blocks. If I walk up to it, throw something in, it's gone. Very efficient. So I'm going to show you a couple of ways that um, people think you can kill an enderman or harm an enderman. The first one is the snowball. Now, of course, the snowball on any mob won't harm it, but it will anger it. See? It's a hit of slime. It's not hurting it in any way. I can do as many shots as I like. It's just going to annoy it. The enderman is, of course, no exception to this rule, except for if I throw a snowball at him. As I explained in my first Minecraft video, He'll move away. Enderman can't be hit by projectiles. Um, unless you have the Elemental Arrows mod, or some of the mods like that, which uh, allow an arrow to be homed in on the Enderman, which means he can't get away and he will get hit. Now, of course, that will mean that this one will be quite obvious as well, the bow. People try and attack Enderman with bows. Don't. It's completely useless. He's gone. Yeah, um, there's no way you can actually get him, of course he's in this, the only way you can get out is teleport. Um, he even can dodge him, as I showed before, in a minecart, where somehow he'll teleport in the minecart. Still in the minecart. Now, of course, the easiest way to beat up an enderman is this. A big bucket of water. Put it in and watch him die. Of course, I assume he'll teleport out. Yeah. Well, you can see him, I think he's dead now, but you can see him sort of flash. And of course, it is the easiest way to kill him, is if you can get it to rain or pour water on them, because 20 hearts of health, you don't want to get one angry. But one quick trick I should probably mention is how to stop an enderman coming after you. Of course, when you've looked at one accidentally and you're not on creative, you're doomed, really. So what can you do? Well, it's to do with the water again. Instead of using the water as a sort of weapon to attack the Enderman, in fact, hide in it. So if I put down our Enderman here, change it to uh, survival, and uh, hopefully nothing will attack me. No, I'm just gonna. Hopefully nothing will attack me, but it did. So I'm gonna, without shouting, I'm gonna do it again. I'm very quiet. I'm not shouting furiously at the game, uh, throwing my laptop on the floor. I'm not screaming. I'm not about to go on an amazing rampage with TNT. Here's an Enderman! Yay! Don't blow me up! So I'm going to go into the middle of this water that's 
quite a few blocks away from the edge. Now let's get an angry Enderman. The Enderman is scared of water, as I'm sure you know, so he won't attack me. As long as I'm here, I can't be hurt by him. Now, uh oh, uh -oh. Uh -oh. get me now. Just calm down. So there you have it. You want to save yourself from an enderman? All you need is a big bucket of water. Hope this helps.